hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back. I'm Jeff. We are all the Animal Donut family. Today I want to update you on the Animal Donut ETF, Ando. And this is a fictional ETF. You can't actually buy shares in this. But I told you guys at the start of this month that I was going to make a portfolio. The goal is to beat the S&P 500. So far, this portfolio is just crushing it. So want to update you on the holdings. So as you know, the holdings in this one were Constellation Energy, Vistra Energy, Axon Therapeutics, Eaton, and Modine Manufacturing. And when I checked this portfolio this morning, and I had a feeling something might happen because I noticed Modine Manufacturing was down a lot in the after hours market yesterday. And I thought, oh, they must have come out with an earnings prediction or an earnings report um, guidance for the future that didn't look as rosy as people had hoped, but the stock was going down. This morning I woke up and I checked my portfolio and it was gone. And you guys might know why. When I made this portfolio, I've been learning a lot about stock trading and trying to take the best lessons that I can learn from professional stock traders. And one of them is you need to protect the downside. You need to limit losses in a way that you don't have to think about it, you don't have to hem and haw and should I sell this stock, it's down 28% or it's down 35 or it's fallen 50%, what should I do? So what I did was I set up a trailing stop loss for each of these five stocks. And Modine Manufacturing, what it did was it didn't fall 20% today and automatically sell. The trailing stop loss follows the stock price as it goes up. And then if it starts to drop, it sells when it drops 20% from here to here. So it might have only fallen 10% at the maximum today, but it had been up 10% higher earlier in the week. So cumulatively, the stock had fallen 20% from its high. I set my trailing stop loss to just sell the position. And then I decided, hey, I don't want cash sitting in my account. This is not all about like just stockpiling cash. This is about putting it to work to beat the S&P 500's return. So I have a list of stocks that I am following. These are about 10 stocks that I thought, you know, I want to buy this stock but I don't have infinite money to invest in infinite stock. So what I decided is since I have about $1,000 added to my brokerage from the sale of Modine Manufacturing, I'm gonna take that and reinvest it. And I'm not even gonna wait. I'm not gonna give it a week or a couple of weeks to think about it. I'm just putting that money back into the market. So I decided to invest in Transmedics Group, TMDX. I made a video about this earlier this year. I like the company. They make really cool machinery that preserve organs like heart, liver, lungs, so that when a donor gives their organ to somebody else, it can be transported in a physiological viable way, whether it means keeping it cold enough or keeping it warm enough, keeping the tissues infused with oxygen so that when they get to the recipient, they're in the optimal condition for transplant. So I went ahead and I placed an order to buy seven shares of Transmedics and it filled automatically. It filled right away. It was a limit order. And I then I went and I placed a stop, a trailing stop loss on this position because like with the others, I wanna make sure that if the stock price drops by 20%, it sells. Because I'm not in a game of getting emotional about stocks that have gone down. I'm not playing this game of I hope it rebounds or maybe if this sector comes back or maybe the stock will rebound. No, if you drop 20%, it's protecting the downside, the trailing stop loss is my friend, this is again not financial advice, but this is what I'm learning about trading, and my main gist of this portfolio is to limit the downside in stock losses and to let the winners run. I hope this has been helpful to you. Let me know what you think. Uh, do you own Transmedics Group? Is that a stock you already own? Have you been learning about it? Uh, what do you think about Vistra Energy, Constellation Energy, 
Eaton or Axome Therapeutics. Always love to hear from you guys. Leave your comments in the section below and I will see you in the next video.